Um, what are the kinds of things that these groups can provide that will help students? Image descriptions, we've talked a bit about that. Uh, various access modes to images, including uh, tactile graphics and, and other tactile um, <coughs> formats. And of course, they need to provide timely access. If you provide all this great stuff two years after the kid had to take biology, it's not very helpful. So how do students, how does helping students actually also help the content providers? Well, this is kind of the cool thing. Dave and I are in great agreement on this because uh, think about how much more discoverable your assets are if you have really good image descriptions. So I talk to publishers and others who have you know, more and more large image asset databases, and it really helps to drive right down into that if you have it uh, well described. Uh, it enriches the, the this, these uh, activities enrich the content for everyone, to Dave's point. But we also need to make sure that it's quicker, cheaper, and easier to produce this way than it has been. 